Gone. No sign of them this side. How about you, Snow Lee? Nope, nothing. All I see is sea. Full of nothing as far as the eye can see. Poor thing. Those speedboats. They shouldn't be allowed. The poor animals and fish must get hurt all the time. They do. It's very dangerous. I spend most of my time on the bottom feeding off the plants or looking after my babies. But I'm a manatee, not a fish. 
I'm a mammal. I've got to come to the surface every few minutes to breathe air. A mama what? Not a mama what? A mammal! The manatee breathes air, slowly, like you and me. She's a mammal, not a fish. She looks like a fish to me. But if you say so... Lately, it's got worse and worse. That speedboat must be the one that keeps racing backwards and forwards all day long. I don't know why. I really don't know why. It's gonna be big. Bigger than big. It'll be enormous. Money? We'll make so much money, we'll need a ten-ton truck to drive it to the bank. <laughs> Just you wait and see. Uh, what's that? Now, right now, even as we speak, my boys are down in Florida testing. I can see it. See it in all the newspapers. The Ratco Powerboat Grand Prix. <laughs> if I get my way, there'll be hundreds of powerboats whipping across the waves down there. <laughs> Think of all the noise. <laughs> Think of all that churned up water. Think of all the people. And of all that money. <laughs> all for me. Uh, us. Uh, Ratco. You know what I mean. <laughs> Not too clever at paddling. <sighs> and I'm starting to feel a bit, you know, seasick. Just follow the manatee. I'm doing my best, but don't blame me if I turn green. Look. What's that over there, I? Mm, land, I hope. What, Slowly? Where? There, see? That little thing bobbing up and down in the water. Less of the bobbing up and down, if you don't mind. <laughs> Quick, I, I follow that manatee. I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best in all very difficult circumstances. Oh, there! It's a baby. It's a cat. Really? Does it go moo? No, slowly. It's not that kind of cat. It's a baby manatee. They're called calves too. That's funny. No one's laughing. Not that kind of funny, Slowly. I mean, funny strange. Not funny ha-ha. It's funny because it reminds me of something, but I can't think what. A mermaid. That's it. A mermaid. It looks just like a mermaid. Well done, Slowly. I'm not just a pretty face. Sometimes I get things right. Uh, what's a mermaid? Honestly, Slowly, I'll tell you what a mermaid was. It was a strange creature that sailors used to tell stories about. It was half woman, half fish. I bet it was a manatee. I bet that's what they saw. There's no such thing as a mermaid anyway. I wouldn't be too sure about that. Some people would tell you there's no such thing as a flying dragon. But I'm one. Large as life and twice as lovely, ain't I? It's no hell. He must have a job for us to do. Well, what are you waiting for? Answer it. What? Ratchelie only wants to run powerboat Grand Prix races off the coast of Florida? Doesn't he know that the sea is very shallow there? Doesn't he know that the propellers of his awful speedboats can hurt living creatures? There's a species called Trichacus manatus living down there. Or to give it its common name... The manatee. The manatee. And my statistics tell me you know about the manatee? <laughs> know how we know about the manatee. Aha, uh -huh. then you should know it's no laughing matter. These beautiful creatures are endangered. Why do you know that they're the origin of the ancient legend of the, the, uh... Mermaid? Of the mermaid, yes. Who said that? Me. Slowly. So how do you know so much about mermaids all of a sudden? We asked one. Oh, that's all right then. You what? You asked a mermaid? No, a manatee. We're with a mother manatee and her calf right now. We helped save it from a bunch of dirty rats and a noisy speedboat. So the stories are true. Ratco rats are already down there. They must be stopped. You must stop them. Or else life won't be worth living for the manatees. Bambouli, do your best. I'm telling you. It was a bird. A bird? 
It was the size of a ten-ton truck. What sort of bird is that? A big bird. Now forget it. We got work to do. Wait, guys. Look. What's that over there? It's ginormous. Let's get out of here, quick. He's gonna run us down. What's the Navy doing here? That's all we need. Slow us turn both. Slow us turn both, sir. Whatever for. He's stopping. Maybe he'll give us a lift. Maybe he won't. He ain't stopping for no one. Yeah, but why is he going so slow? Somebody had a funeral or something? Slow ahead both. Steady as she goes. But I don't understand, sir. All right, Lieutenant. As it's your first trip with us, I'll show you. Come on, let's see if our friends are at home. We have to go very slowly here, Lieutenant. Regulation orders. This is manatee water. We have to take proper care not to churn up the seabed and wreck their feeding grounds, or run them down, of course. Unlike some people, look at those clowns down there. Hey, wait, wait, what are you staring at, you big bazookas? Yeah, I've never seen a real boat before. Yeah, not like their floating tin can, eh, number one? <laughs> Think how fast we could go if we had an engine that big. Brum, 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 me. What do you think? I think I'm gonna be sick. That's what I think. I think. Too many fizzy drinks. Not good for you. Listen, we don't want to know about that. We don't want to know about monsters or your opinions or fizzy drinks. In fact, I'd just like some peace and quiet to get the boat started again. Having to swerve like that must have got water into the engine. Having to swerve like that for the monster. What did you say? Nothing. Hmm. Can we go back to dry land for a bit, please? I suppose so. We've done enough testing for one day. We can finish off tomorrow. Then we can tell Mr. Rattleone everything's fine down here. And we can start bringing down all the power boats. Hundreds and hundreds. It'll be great. That'll scare your monsters off. In fact, that'll scare everything off for a hundred miles at least. <laughs> uh, go slow. Hold on to your stomachs. <laughs> 14 rats on a dead rat stomach. <laughs> So that's how it is, everyone. All the other manatees feel so frightened about those speedboats. We've all come very close to being hit and hurt. But what can we do? We live here, and this is our home. We've got nowhere else to go. I just wish they'd go away and leave us all in peace. I'm thinking. I'm thinking real hard. I'm trying to come up with a plan, something that'll get rid of those rats once and for all. I don't know what to say. I can't think straight. I'm so tired. Perhaps if we sleep, honey, in the morning, maybe we'll, we'll come up with a plan. All this sea air. Oh, I could sleep away. Good night, Ai Ai. Darling, slowly. Good night, manatee. Sweet dreams. I know what I'm going to dream about. Nobody knows what they're going to dream about, slowly. You see, dreams don't work like that. Mine do. Pirate legends and mysteries. And the Bermuda Triangle in food, of course. The Bermuda what? The Bermuda Triangle. It's just a story. There's supposed to be a place where mysterious things happen at sea, off the coast here, really? towards the island of Bermuda. Oh. Ships and planes vanish without trace. It's all just a, uh, just a fairy tale. This is terrible. It's getting really hard to see which way is up and which way is down. I don't know where this mist has come from. It was a lovely sunny day just a moment ago. Mm. And it's cold. It's suddenly chilly. I thought the island of Bermuda was supposed to be sunny. Yeah, we're not there yet. Perhaps it'll warm up when we arrive. If we arrive. What do you mean, if? Look at this. Do you know what this means? It means you need a new compass. It means we're in the Bermuda Triangle, the home of sea monsters and all sorts of horrible creatures. Remember what I told you, Bambolee? The Bermuda Triangle? That's just a fairy tale. You 
think so, eh? I know so. Then how do you explain those? such a beautiful dream. I was just visiting my auntie in Dover-on-Sea and we were eating cockles and mussels and, oh, I love cockles. I've got it. A cockle? No, a plan. To get cockles? <laughs> no, a plan to get rid of rats. Mm, that's nice. Now, can we go back to sleep for a bit, please? I've got to get back to my dream or my auntie will have eaten all the cockles. For a dragon, she's a real pig for cockles. A plan? Have you got a plan, Bambooly? A real dream of a plan. <laughs> Just you wait and see. Come on, you two. Shake a leg. Let's get it launched. The sooner we have one last test run, the sooner we can all go home. And the sooner Mr. Rapplione will pay us for our work. Look there! What? Where? There! See? Something. It's just fog, mist. It's like this Sunday's early in the morning. We're not afraid of a little bit of misty wisty, are we? I don't like it. You never know what's in the, uh, fog. That's easy. You're gonna be in it in just a minute when we get this boat launched. Now, come on! Push! Anyway, I don't suppose we'll see a monster two days running. That'd be too much of a coincidence. Right. Are we almost there yet? Where? Where we're going. You see, I feel a bit, uh, um, uh, uh. It was till you started talking. Can we go home now? I feel like a nice rest. Somewhere that doesn't bubble. Stop that moaning. You can't feel that bad. But I wasn't. <laughs> and stop scratching. If you scrape the paintwork, Mr. Rattleone will take it out of our, uh, your salaries. But I wasn't. Ah, uh, here it is. What? The extra fuel. Too. If we don't get this work finished, now, for the very last time, there is no such thing as sea monsters, right? You two, sit down! Sit down! You're rocking the boat! 
I've never known such babies. Yeah, you can hear that. That's a monster, a monster in a deep. This place is haunted. You can never have a powerboat race here. They keep disappearing. We'll have to tell Mr. Rattleone. He'll have to cancel. I don't believe in sea monsters. I won't believe in sea monsters, not unless I see one with my own two eyes. the last you'll see is them. And they won't stop running till they're 100 miles inland. And that'll be the end of their idea for a Racco powerboat race. They'll be far too scared to come back here in a hurry. And the manatees and all the other creatures can have a peaceful summer. Thank you. Thank you so much. I could never have done it without you all. And I could never have thought of it without Slow Lee and his Bermuda Triangle stories. They may just be fairy tales, but they certainly gave me an idea of how to scare off the rats. I don't know. There were some strange creatures there under the sea. <laughs> now, don't you start. Next thing you'll be saying is that there really are sea monsters out there. <laughs> <laughs> 